Well, you know, supercapacitors are just as important as they ever were, and you want to know why? That's coming right up. Well, we're at the 2017 Battery Show, Critical Power Show, EV Electronic Show, all that stuff. And, uh, and I'm in the Maxwell booth, and with me is Marty Mills. You remember Marty. And uh, so, Marty, tell us what's been going on at Maxwell since the last time we talked. Well, thanks, Jim. It's great to be here again. And uh, it's been a pretty exciting time at Maxwell. We've had a couple things happen over the last couple of years since we talked last. Uh, two years ago, we were able to announce finally our start-stop system that we've had with PSA Peugeot in Europe. Uh, we did announce uh, two years ago that we had that same uh, start-stop voltage stabilization system used for General Motors uh, on the Cadillac ATS and CTS uh, sedan. So it's exciting to have a North American OEM uh, adapt our technology. So that's one of the newer things that we got more to come that are uh, different applications for automotive that we can talk about a little further. Right. Well, I realize you can't tell us everything about what's going on <laughs> right, Wish right we now. Could, but <laughs> yeah, well, that, that, that's always good. But um, actually, uh, ultra capacitors are just as important as they always have been, right? And I wonder if you could tell us a little bit more about uh, why that is. Well, ultra capacitors are very uh, power dense devices. They can be used for start stop applications. Their charge and discharge rates are uh, far superior to batteries where you can charge and discharge them up to a million cycles. So they last the lifetime of the vehicle uh, in most applications that we size them for. So that's a big advantage. The temperature range that we can operate into from minus 40 degrees uh, up to 65 degrees C uh, is a big advantage, in especially cold environments. Uh, but I think that the uh, one of the biggest advantages that we see is they're being used for not only for uh, high cycling applications like start stop, they're being used for backup power applications uh, for, say, autonomous driving which is becoming more important in our world today. Yeah, that's for sure. And uh, some of you guys have been keeping up with autonomous driving. You know that the, the duty cycle on these vehicles is uh, like all day long, you know. I don't know where your car is right now, but if it's sitting in a parking lot and nobody's using it, well, if it's a shared autonomous vehicle, it's being used all the time. So you got to have all kinds of power and backup power and, and that sort of thing. So I think, and, and Marty will agree with this, that ultra capacitors are becoming more and more relevant, I think, in the, uh, in the automotive uh, business today. Um, so, Marty, one of the things that we um, uh, got from the last video, and for those of you who uh, haven't seen it or would like to see it again, click on the card up here in the corner and it'll run the last interview that Marty and I did on ultra capacitors. But we had a lot of comments. Uh, what, how do we find out more about Maxwell? How do we find out more about ultra capacitors? Where do we go to get that information? Sure, we have a, the website's easy as heck, it's uh, maxwell.com and we've got a variety, we show uh, the different applications and markets that we're in, uh, automotive uh, being one of them for, as I said, start, stop, active suspension, e-turbo, e-electronic power steering, our applications, we also have uh, sites for the wind turbine, pitch control, backup power that we're doing, uh, and a variety of other applications, but not only on uh, maxwell.com, if you go to the downloads page, there's all the uh, data sheets and spec sheets for all of our products and what they're used for in those different applications in different markets, as well as uh, many times uh, user manuals that you really get into the uh, nitty gritty for, for the high tech people who want to dive into it. Right, and that's exactly what we need, information like that. So, in the metadata down below, we're going to put the uh, contact information for Maxwell uh, so you can get all this type of information that you need. So, if you guys need to know more about uh, ultra capacitors or if you're thinking of ways to use them yourself, you really need to check out Maxwell's ultra capacitors.